Forget all the jokes about the Land Rovers and Jaguars lack of reliability. People who can actually afford these cars know their worth and value their quality. If you're here, you must be a true connoisseur of the British automotive luxury and you would appreciate the new model entries that the conglomerate has to offer. And this video will cover upgraded Jaguars, Land and Range Rovers of 2023 and 2024. So subscribe to Automotive Territory and stay tuned for the freshest car news. We start the engines now. Range Rover Velar The youngest Range Rover model that was launched just in 2017 has reached the first facelift. This year, the Velar is undergoing a mild exterior redesign that includes a fresh grille, new LED lighting units, blackout trim, and a tweaked rear bumper. As before, the Velar shares the chassis with the Jaguar F-Pace and comes equipped with air suspension that has been specially tuned for a premium comfort ride. The engine's lineup includes two turbo mills, a 2.0-liter four-cylinder and a 3.0-liter inline-six, both with standard all-wheel drive. Inside the cabin, the latest updates consist of the option to wrap the interior in leather, wool and polyurethane, and you can also trim it in wood, metal or aluminum. Additionally, the Velar now features a new curved infotainment display with a diagonal of 11 inches, active noise cancellation and an optional air purifier. Land Rover Defender 130 With the addition of this model, Land Rover effectively offers a Defender in all major size segments. The full-size 130 stretches to 211 inches in overall length, while keeping the 110's 119 inches wheelbase. Thanks to this update, the Defender can now fit an adult-size third row. The entry-level 4-cylinder and the V8 flagship are removed from the offerings. So the 130 is on sale only with a 3-liter turbocharged melt hybrid engine and 296 horsepower P300 and a 395 HP P400 versions. These are coupled with an 8-speed ZF automatic gearbox and an all-wheel drive. The SUV is rated to 280-200 pounds, while 0 to 60 now takes 7.5 and 6.3 seconds depending on the engine. This family hauler keeps the Defender's adventure spirit with an air suspension with adaptive dampers and 35.4 inches of water weighting capability. It provides royally comfortable accommodations with an exclusive Sedona Red upholstery, four-zone climate control and a new optional curved display 11.4 inches in diagonal. Range Rover Sport The all-new 2023 version of the mid-sized Range Rover Sport belongs to the third generation of the model and builds on the new MLA Flex architecture. The SUV grows in wheelbase length by 3 inches, offers more elegant styling and features improved LED lighting tech. As before, the Sport gets a variety of engines, most of which are now electrified. The entry-level mills are 3-liter gasolines and diesel inline-six cylinders with mild hybrid tech. Next comes a duo of plug-in hybrids making 440 and 510 horses, and the top performer is a 4.4-liter twin-turbo V8 with 530 HP. The cabin houses 22-way power seats, features active noise cancellation, and gets a new cockpit with a 13.7-inch driver's display. Finally, those who want a more exclusive Range Rover Sport can choose the 20-unit Deer Valley Edition. It is priced at 165k, built on the Range Rover Sport autobiography, gets unique deep glass vermilion red exterior, 23-inch satin dark grey wheels and an optional Alpine skyroof box. Jaguar I-Pace The original luxury electric SUV has been in mass production for five years now so it's high time for Jaguar to give it a slight spruce up. The I-Pace of 2024 is putting on a smooth radiator grille, new air intakes with Atlas grey blades and an updated Jaguar logo in black and silver. The model line is now comprised of the I-Pace 400 Sport and three R-Dynamic trims, R-Dynamic S, R-Dynamic SE 
and our Dynamic HSE. All of them come standard with the black pack and diamond cut alloy wheels up to 22 inches in size. The powertrain demonstrates the same performance figures of 400 horsepower and 292 WLTP miles of range, but the recharge rate was increased to 100 kW. The upgrades to the cabin include a PV Pro infotainment, wireless Apple and Android connectivity, integrated Alexa, and over the air updates to the software and navigation maps. Jaguar F-Pace Following the electrification commitment, Jaguar has updated its F-Pace SUV with a larger battery pack and the P400E plug-in hybrid version. The 9-module lithium-ion pack increases the energy storage capacity to 19.2 kWh, raising its electric-only range by over 20% to 40 miles. The P400E's performance is rated at 404 horsepower combined enabling acceleration from 0 to 60 mph in just 5 seconds. As for the rest of the lineup, the F-Pace range has been streamlined to include only our Dynamic S, SE, HSE, 400 Sport and SVR models. All of them feature an intelligent all-wheel drive and an 8-speed automatic transmission. The F-Pace's assured dynamic presence is further heightened with the black pack. It is now standard on all models from the R Dynamic SE. The cars also come with more technology and an improved PV Pro infotainment system. There is a rumor that likes on YouTube are a digital currency of luck. The more thumbs up you give, the more success you receive. Try it out. Thanks in advance and we keep rolling. Land Rover Defender 75th Limited Edition The anniversary of the original Defender is coming up next year, but the Brits are already gearing up for the celebration. The 75th Limited Edition, built on the latest Defender L663 and the well-equipped HSE guys. It dresses the SUV in an exclusive grass-mirror green livery with 75 years graphics and 20-inch wheels wearing the same finish. The model also gets off-road tires, silver painted bumpers and two roof options, a folding fabric top or a fixed panoramic glass panel. Available on the 90 and 110 models, the limited edition offers three drivetrain configurations, two mild hybrids and a plug-in hybrid based on the 2.0-liter Turbo 4 and rated for 388 horses. The standard equipment list includes an air suspension, 3D cameras and an 11-inch PV Pro infotainment. Plus, this edition brings black trimmed seats and 75 years details. Land Rover Classic Defender Works V8 Trophy 2 For Rages, the Defender has been a go-to vehicle to complete global expeditions, so the team from Land Rover Classic is paying tribute to its legacy by releasing 25 unique models that will be eligible for participation in the next installment of the Land Rover Trophy competition. The Classic Defender Works V8 Trophy 2 vehicles are finished in unique expedition-inspired camouflage and come in a choice of 90, 110 and 110 double cap pickup body designs. Each vehicle will be powered by a 405 horsepower 5 liter V8 engine with an 8 speed ZF automatic transmission. They will get upgraded brakes and a handling kit. Additional all terrain equipment includes front A frame with an integrated winch, powerful full width LED light bar, rock sliders, and roll cage. The cabin features two-toned Recaro Windstor leather sports seats, dashboard and tram, Land Rover Classic infotainment system and an Elliott brown clock face that mirrors the camouflage. Jaguar F-Type 75 years Jaguar has confirmed that the 2024 model year will be the last for the F-Type coupe and convertible. The 75 edition will mark the end of the lineup and will be available in both 444HP P450 and 575HP P575 models. The 75 edition comes with the badges of the F-Type silhouette on the front fender, door sills and center console. The interior will also feature 75 emblems and an R etched into the R model squad exhaust pipes. The special edition will come with the mechanical upgrades including lightweight rear knuckles, larger wheel bearings 
and redesigned upper bolt joints that will make the steering more communicative. The 75 edition will have all-wheel drive as an option and will be standard for the R models. Both will get a rear electronic active differential and adaptive dampers. Lastly, for the F-Type's final trip around the sun, there will also be minor color and trim changes across the entire lineup. Give us your personal evaluation of the new Jaguar Land Rover mix. Are they unreliable money pits or rather sophisticated products for the true admirers who can afford them? Your answers are welcome in the comment section below. Smash the like button to boost your luck, subscribe to Automotive Territory Daily News and proceed to exploring other car lineups through the links on the screen. May the torque be with you!